bring up the wonderful world of wizardry. Fantastic. And let's bring up the magic mapping parchment. Okay, great. All right, whiz kids, let's get down to a little whizness. Real world updates. Okay, once again, prompting the uh, ever present question of whether or not YouTube is actually part of the real world. I'll give a brief channel update here. A recent video of mine seems to have caused a bit of a stir and doubled my subscriber uh, count. So welcome to all the new subscribers. Welcome and fair warning. <laughs> my channel is a little schizophrenic as far as content goes, if you haven't already noticed. So don't expect what you saw in my last video each and every time I hit the upload button. This wizardry series and labor of love being a world apart from that video and an obvious case in point. I try to keep things as unique as possible on this channel, which as far as positive reception goes is pretty iffy. It, uh, it makes things very much hit or miss. So be it. Whether the general public approves or not, the amulet must be found. All right, World of Wizardry updates. Um, if you're old enough to remember Team Foolish Pride's last adventure in the Proving Grounds, you know they earned their new moniker. In particular, Elevator went from a minor deity wiping out entire groups of monsters all at once with one little incantation to a lifeless sack of bones pretty quick. She got killed after Team Foolish Pride foolishly underestimated and mishandled a group of level 7 mages. Luckily, however, Band Mike Bossy was able to bring her back from the dead. But our intrepid adventurers have been licking their wounds in Gilgamesh's ever since. They look for any excuse to hang out in Gilgamesh's way too long. And uh, take some much needed time off from the ever so capricious and cruel proving grounds. But I think they're ready for another go, so let's drag them off their bar stools and get started here. Okay. Gilgameshes. Let's get the party, get everybody added into the party. Ryan Miller, Run DMCA, Ban Mike Bossy. Gnome de Plume, Snarkeesian, and Elevator. Right, so the only party member that has leveled since last time is Snarkeesian. I believe she is now level 11. Correct, she's the only level 11 party member. And as you can see, I think she got four hit points when she leveled, something like that. And uh, her, you know, her. she's not very pious, but uh, I think she lost some piety points uh, when she leveled. I think she loses piety points, but it doesn't matter. Every time she levels, she loses piety. It doesn't matter. She's a thief. Why do thieves need to be pious? Her IQ is uh, a little troubling. Thieves need to be smarter than that, probably. But, um, you know, uh, we'll live with it. Okay, so let's get into the Proving Grounds here. Enough. To oh, you know what? Before we go into the Proving Grounds, I just remembered, I think somebody in the group has another one of those damn plus one short swords that I forgot to get identified. And I think that person is banned Mike Bossy. The uh, last event, before the last adventuring session in the Proving Grounds, the party went to Baltax and unloaded some some stuff, if uh, um, all three of you who watch this series remember. So, for whatever reason, I, I didn't see one remaining unidentified sword in Van Mike Bossy's uh, list of stuff. So, let's get him to Baltax and let's correct that um, uh, inventory mishandling there. Okay, so... We are going to have Ban Mike Bossy go in. He is going to pool gold because I think it's a very expensive. Ooh, do I have enough gold pieces to identify this thing? I do not. Would you look at that? I thought I had enough gold pieces to identify it. 
I need about a thousand more gold pieces. All right, so much for that. We'll have to uh, identify it maybe the, you know, after a, a couple returns to the castle here. Okay, so scratch that. Let's get to the brewing grounds. Edge of town. Maze. All right, let's have Van Mike Bossy cast everybody's favorite spell, Maporfic, and only Maporfic, because if we cast Low Milwa, we know what happens when we get into that dark region on the first level. Okay, great. So let's get out of camp here. Do not take the stairs back up. And there it is, the lovely Proving Grounds. Okay, let's get to it. Head down to the fifth level, the dreaded fifth level. All right, here we are. Everybody will take a deep fifth level breath here. <laughs> and uh, head about our adventuring business here. Now, I think since we rudely got teleported over to the left there on the fifth level map and had to kind of um, uh, find our way back to familiar territory um, and we kind of explored a little bit of the left hand of uh, so to speak the left hand side of level five let's head over to the right hand side here and it's a bit of a torturous path you know they the uh, whoever made the proving grounds either Wordna or Trevor they couldn't just put a door right there for me come on now I need a spell to change the architecture of the Proving grounds. All right, so oop, an encounter, and I forgot to cast Low Milwa. Level seven mages. Uh, we learned our lesson with the last group. <laughs> Level seven mages. See you, boys. Have a nice day, and I hope you didn't hear what what happened with the last group of level seven mages. Okay, so let's get into camp real quick here. Have Ban Mike Bossy cast Low Milwa. There we go. And get out of camp. All right, nice. Now we can see a lot farther in the Proving Grounds here. An encounter. Six werewolves and we surprised them. All right, fight, 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 parry, parry, parry. 12 damage, werewolf is killed. 16 damage. Okay, fight, fight, fight. Spell Mamatu. And I think we're gonna save our spell points for other encounters, right? So parry, parry. And misses, misses, misses. Come to bloom, cast by Matu. Misses, misses. Werewolf is killed. Werewolf is killed. Good job. Brute force members of the party. Fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. 16 damage. 20. Five damage, six damage, misses, misses, misses. We like that. All right, fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. Let's finish these guys off. Nice. Werewolf is killed. Eight damage. Werewolf is killed. Misses. All right, one more little bugger left here. Fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. Werewolf is killed. Very nice. Okay, so we had some interesting issues uh, with chests the previous adventuring session. Let's see if we got over that. Calfo, and that's going to be Gnome de Plume, who hopefully has worked out his Calfo issues in the time off from the Proving Grounds. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, let's... Now that Snarkeesian is 11th level, let's have her put her inspection skills to work here. Alright, Snarkeesian. Um, let's see, would you teleport? Okay. Got two corroborating uh, bits of info here. So we'll assume it is a teleporter, and Snarkeesian will be able 
to disarm it, correct? Nice, very nice. Found the staff, and 40 gold pieces each. Nice, okay, let's get out of the encounter window and continue on our merry adventuring way. All right, so this door is where we gotta go through, right? To get to that undiscovered right side. Uh, I guess we could have guessed from the way the map is shaped that this would be a long hallway with a left turn. Okay, and a door at the end. Right. All right, is there any, just out of curiosity, no, no way to get back into the discovered section. All right, here goes. An encounter. Four attack dogs that we surprised. Okay. Fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. Attack dog is killed. Eight damage. Attack dog is killed. Now, what do you suppose attack dogs can do to our party? What terrible, like, poison them or something unfortunate like that? Fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. Attack dog is killed. 14 damage. And misses. All right. Fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. 7 damage. Misses. Oh, come on. We got one attack dog left here. Thank you. Okay. 746 experience points and another chest. Calfo. That's going to be Nim de Plume. Gas Bomb. We are going to assume his Calfo is no longer on the blink. And that's going to be Snarkeesian. Gas Bomb. Disarm the trap. Nice work, Snarkeesian. Found armor. 48 gold pieces each. Okay. So far, so good here in the fifth level. Let's not get too cocky, though. All right. Um, this is a 4x4 four four square room. Wizardry seems filled with similar rooms, doesn't it? Proving grounds, excuse me. All right. Back out into what looks like a hallway. Okay. Walk through walls. Now that's going to lead us down to the other section, one would assume, if we go that way. Uh, huh. Huh. Let's give it a go. See where it leads us. Leads us to an encounter. Friendly group of spirits. Have a nice spooky day, spirits. Okay, got a door there, and we've got a dead end really is a dead end because we've got low Noa going. Alright, before I go through that door there, let's see where this other hallway leads. Very hallway-like, leading to doors. And two more hallway. Interesting. Okay. Before we go down, let's check out some of these rooms here. An encounter. The uh, fifth level is feeling very friendly today, thankfully. Alright, see you later, dragon puppies. Gotta wonder if we meet them again if they won't feel as friendly. An encounter. Three wolves, you surprise the monsters. Fight, 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 parry, parry, parry. 10 damage, 16 damage, misses, all right, fight, 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 parry, 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 12 damage, these are some tough wolves, the wolf is killed, misses, wolf is killed, <clears throat> fight, 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 parry, 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 wolf is killed, all right. Nice job so far, everybody. Team Foolish Pride, brimming with Foolish Pride. Calfo, we'll have uh, Bam Mike Bossy Calfo this one. Exploding Box. Okay, Disarm, that's going to be Snarkeesian. Exploding Box. 
Disarm the trap. 31 gold pieces and no goodies. All right. So be it. Uh, oops, gotta get out of the encounter window. And then we gotta get synced up there. Okay, much more betterer. Okay, so we've got hallway and we've got two doors. I guess we'll go down to this door here and uh, check out what's in here. An encounter, that's what's in there. Five animals. And nobody surprised anybody. Okay. Um, hmm. All right, so, so be it. So I can cast some spells here in the first round, right? Right. Fight, fight, fight. Uh, Gnome de Plume, you are going to cast Bamatu. And Starkeesian, taking the patriarchal melee off as usual. Elevator. Let's try a Dalto on these five animals. All right. 13 damage, 17 damage. Gnome de Plume tries to cast Bamatu and nothing happens? What? Uh, no, 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 no. What, what, what's that all about? <laughs> Uh-oh, and they're breathing on us. Oh, dear. And this is 21 damage. Ooh. 3 damage, 3 damage. Oh, my goodness. Tell me I can't cast spells in this room? Is that what happened? Two damage. Oh, this is going to be unfortunate. Dalto, but nothing happens. Oh, my goodness. All right. So, is... Now, wait. I cast spells on the rest of the fifth level. What the heck happened here? All right. We are getting smoked. Um, hmm. Just worry about elevator. Um, how many more rounds of breathing can she take? Should I try to exit stage left here and run from this encounter? Oh, goodness. There had to be five of them, right? There couldn't be like two or three of them. Hmm. All right, I think she, she lost like nine hit points. Um, so I think we can survive one more melee round um, as long as we take a couple of them out this melee round oh that's so frustrating that i don't have i can't cast spells all right fight 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 parry 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 animals killed nice come on you gotta get one more for me one more come on get one more for me here animal yes all right who ah, misses 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 nice all right, three dragon puppies. Of course, they couldn't be friendly in this room, could they? Where I can't... Well, then again, I wouldn't know that I couldn't cast spells and might get even deeper into this room before being able to make a decision about getting deeper into this room. Oh, man. Okay, fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. Come on now. Misses. Don't miss, Bam, my boss. This is not the time to miss. Yes. Dragon puppies killed. Dragon puppies killed. Nice. There's one more left. Alright, that's for five damage. That's okay as long as he's not breathing on everybody. Fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. And 19 damage. Dragon Puppy is killed. Alright, very nice. 1900 experience points. And, well, am I going to be able to Calfo? I don't think. I think I just have to inspect. I think I'll just waste a spell point if I try to Calfo in here, right? Inspect. And that will be. Snarkeesian, teleporter. Okay, Snarkeesian, you better, better be right about that. Let's see, that's going to be Snarkeesian, teleporter. Disarm the trap. 28 gold pieces. Okay, very nice. Now, if I can't cast spells, why is my light and protect still going? I guess you just can't initiate. It won't snuff magic in here, but... It also won't let you initiate any magic. All right. Uh, wow, and it's a big room, too. Figures. All right, I'm getting out of here. <laughs> and I'm assuming I can't go into camp and heal everybody in there. So let's see if I can do it outside the door. Oof. Man. 
Now, every time I go through that door, I'm probably going to get an encounter, too, aren't I? Oh, boy. Let's get into camp and heal everybody up. All right, then, Mike Bossy. Time to uh, Dios, like it's 1989. Miller Fizzle. Uh-oh. What the hell happened here? Oh, does it, like, permanently fizzle my spellcasting ability until I go back to the castle? Or am I, am I magic-free for the rest of my life here now? Oh, my goodness. This is not good. Fizzle? All right. Um... Wow. Or, or maybe maybe it's this hallway? Alright, let's leave camp and head down the hallway here. Oh, oh no. Surprise the monsters. Two shades. Fight, fight, fight. Ah, parry, parry, parry. Shade is killed. Shade is killed. Nice work. All right, getting pretty lucky, so I experienced my 38 gold pieces, no chest, which is good, because my Calho doesn't work, I guess. Now, is it just, what section of the, let's try to get into camp now? And let's try to get Bam Mike Bossy to cast Dios, right? Miller, fizzle, oh no! Has it permanently tainted me? <laughs> What's going on? Oh my goodness. Okay, let's see if going back up to the castle or another level or something cures me of whatever is ailing me at the moment. Oh, that is terrible. Why did I go into that room or wherever I went into to have that happen to me? Is the fifth level going to let me out alive now? Ah, oh, I made it to the elevator. Very nice. Okay. Fourth level. Yep, please. Let's go through the door. Through that door. Alright, um, let's try to get into camp here and see what happens. Uh, Dan Mike Bossy. And spell Dios on Ryan Miller. Ah, there we go. So, what does that mean to me? Does that mean... Where did I lose the ability? Was it in that room or what? I mean, I assumed it was in that room, but it might have been somewhere at some point earlier on. Alright, anyway, let's get everybody healed up here now that the, uh, the old magic uh, wands are working again. Or whatever they use to cast these spells. Okay. Okay, now everybody is healed up. I'm kind of close to the castle. I need some spell points back. So, tell you what, let's go back to the castle. We'll check to see if we have enough gold pieces to do some identification. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Here goes. level encounter. Five orcs that we surprised. Okay, a little pain in the arses. Fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. Orc is killed. Orc is killed. Let me guess the rest are going to run away too. Orc is killed. If they get a chance to. Fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. Orc is killed. Orc is killed. Ha! He didn't get a chance to run away. 195 experience points and 11 gold pieces each. All right, so let's get out of the encounter window and continue on our merry darkness way here. Can't walk through walls, but you can have an encounter. Three small humanoids. Okay, fight, fight, fight. First, uh, the first level must have heard that we were having trouble with our spells, and they're like, ah, time to move in. All right, very, 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 fight. Humanoid is killed. Humanoid is killed. Humanoid is killed. That'll teach you. Seven experience points, 15 gold pieces. Wonderful. And 
get out of the encounter window, make a right turn, okay, and head back up to the castle like I said. <laughs> An encounter! Oh my goodness, then they surprised us. Misses! 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 Kobold runs away! Misses! Kobold runs away! Misses! Three damage! Ah, oh, I've got to do one. Okay. So, fight group one, fight group one, fight group one. Very, 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 very. Kobold runs away! Misses! Three damage! Oh my goodness, they're tearing us apart. Kobold is killed! Runs away. And that leaves us with just orcs, correct? Usually they're the ones that run away. Fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. Orc is killed. Orc is killed. Orc is killed. Okay, great. 186 experience points. Six gold pieces each. And hardly worth the effort, but I guess I better get in camp here. And heal up those little scratches that... I think it was only Ben, Mike, Bossy got. Okay, so. Spell Dios on him. Oop, I can't cast that because I'm out of. Let's try Dion. On himself. Alright, very nice. Okay. And let's see if we can. And maybe finally make it back up to the castle, yeah? Okay, great. So, we want Ban Mike Bossy in Baltex, do we not? So let's see how that goes. That's going to be Ban Mike Bossy. Does he have enough gold? He does! Fantastic! Let's identify what uh, number two, which we already know is a, at least I think we already know, is a plus one short sword. Alright. Anything else? Nope, that's going to be it. Yep, plus one short sword of uselessness. So we're going to get rid of that cell two short sword. Nope, that's it. Okay, let's get out of here and head to Gilgamesh's for a moment to divvy up the gold. Otherwise, party members get jealous if one party member has all the gold. And evil plots start to take shape in party members' minds. You know what I'm saying? All right, let's head back to the... I'm going to head back to the 5th level, and um, I'm going to I'm going to cast Low Milwa right outside the door to that room, or attempt to, to see if it's actually that room that gets me all fugazi magic-wise. Alright, so edge of town, head into the maze, and um, have... Dan Mike Bossy cast our favorite spell, Maporfic. Alright, wonderful. And leave camp. Do not take the stairs back up and head to the fifth level. The, the ever meddlesome and frustrating fifth level. Oh man. What's the sixth level going to be like? What's the seventh level going to be like? The eighth? Uh... Okay. Anyway. Alright, here we are in the magic free zone of the fifth level. Ah, oh, dear. An encounter. Surprise the monsters. Minor Damios. Alright, I think I better get rid of them right away. Fight group two, fight group two, fight group two, and nobody can cast spells. Parry, parry, parry. <clears throat> 22 damage, 23 damage, 13 damage, okay. So, fight group 2, fight group 2, fight group 2, um, spell Bamatu in case they don't get killed. Take the patriarchal melee off and spell... Hmm. Got that bishop there who might cause trouble. I think elevator. 
I don't want to use up a Machinito spell point here. Um, wow, what to do? Um, I tell you what, this this is a strange one, but I'm just going to throw a little Dilto in the works here and hope that, hopefully that keeps the minor Daimyos, Daimyos, whatever Yos, from decapitating anyone. Alright, uh, oh, I can, I can only cast... Okay, I thought that was a multi-party spell, but I guess not. Okay. Misses. Oh, I cast those spells. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Thank you. I'm on to cast quickly, sort of quickly. Misses. Minor Daimyo is killed. Minor Daimyo is killed. Very nice. Not slept. Oh, stupid bishop in your sleep spell. And my bossy is asleep. No, the boot is asleep. Not slept. Elevator is slept. That doesn't matter because it killed most of the minor damage is killed. Nice. So this leaves us with the bishop and half my party asleep. Fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. Ooh, six damage. Fine. Hit somebody while they're asleep, why don't you? There, yeah, that'll learn you. Okay. Um, is. Gnome de Plume is awake, so he can cast Calpo. It's going to be spell number three. Teleporter can. Sarkeesian's awake. We better just for uh, posterity have some corroborating uh, information, data, and evidence here. And that's going to be Sarkeesian who does that. Teleport. Okay. So we're both in agreement on that. Disarm that Sarkeesian because I do not want to be teleported. You know this. I don't have to tell you this every time, do I? Thank you. Found a staff. Oh, you know what? I had other material that I could have uh, identified while I was at the castle. Okay. So be it. Okay, let's get into... Let's get out of the encounter window, get into camp, reorder the way I like things to be reordered. That's going to be Aaron Miller. Oops, that's not what I'm to do. Reorder. Aaron Miller, run DMCA. Ban Mike Boston. Known to Bloom. Snark using... Elevator. All right, now we gotta have who got scratched up there. That was elevator. Right. All right. So let's have Van Mike Bossy heal her on elevator. One more should do the trick. Okay. Very nice. Now we go about our merry business here. Trying to figure out where exactly we are no longer able to cast spells on the fifth level, right? Okay. Heading along the same path we came from not too long ago. An encounter. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh dear. I can smell a Macanito coming, assuming I can cast it. <laughs> oh no, do not do not fall asleep, Elevator, if they cast Catino. I, if they don't kill you, I will. It's not the time to be asleep on the job, Elevator. It's time to rise up like the little minor deity you can be at times. <sighs> Alright. So, well, I guess group one is Daimyo's as well. I mean, here's the dilemma. We've got... Uh, they couldn't be in two groups? Oh, well, not that that really matters. It, it complicates things a little bit. All right. Um, so far, we've been pretty lucky in minor Daimyo's not decapitating anybody. But we've been very unlucky with priests and bishops putting us to sleep. So let's see if we can get rid of one group of priests. Maybe maybe the gods will be smiling smiling on us and allow us to do that this uh, first surprise round here. Fight group two. Fight group two. Fight group two. None of these can be dispelled, right? Unless they're like evil bishops, maybe. Well, let's give it a try. <laughs> Spell group four. Let's see what happens. All right. Everybody else is parrying. Priest is killed. Nice work. Eight damage. Twelve. Uh, I needed you to kill at least two. Dispel fails. Okay. You knew that was coming. Okay, so fight group two. Fight group two. 
All right, I'm gonna have to go with Montino here and hope for the best, right? Um, and you need to cast that on group four. Uh, you need to cast Bamatu big time. You need to twiddle your thumbs and you need the Macanito. Please let Elevator go first. Wizardry gods, please. Priest is killed, nice. Man, oh, there we go. Yes, nice work, Elevator. All right, so we've answered one question here, obviously. Um, the uh, magic canceling effect of level five hasn't happened so far. <laughs> and unfortunately for these bozos it hasn't happened so far because they just got torched see ya <laughs> wow 2500 experience points and this is when we get teleported to somewhere unfortunate and die okay so calfo gnome de plume what's with the teleporter every five seconds all right let's have snarkeesian inspect here and and see if she can uh Verify mage. Uh oh, not good. I'm getting, getting different answers. I don't like it. Calfo. All right, so we've got mage blaster and teleporter, right? You're the uh, the final vote here, band Mike Bossy. Teleporter. Okay, teleporter. It is. Two Calfos told me it's teleporter. Snarkeesian must be still laughing about how easily that party of goons got smoked, or multiple parties of goons, however you say that. All right. Um. Right, so you're going to disarm Snarkeesian, and you're going to disarm a teleporter, right? Right. Disarm the trap. Nice work. 48 gold pieces and no goodies. Okay, I, I, I kind of think we already have our answer here as far... Did anybody get scratched up there? No. We're all in good shape. Um... As far as where the no magic zone is, but all right, we'll uh, we'll follow through with the experiment here. Let's get into camp. Let's have Ban Mike Bossy cast low Milwa like so. Okay, yeah, it's got to be this room, and and oh man, once you once you get into the room. You're messed up until you leave the fifth level. Wow, this room is pretty amazing, really. Um, are there any other, like, bolstering spells I can cast outside of this room to give me an advantage, a magical advantage in there? Um, I mean, it wouldn't be so bad if my, my last three adventurers in the order here could fight as well, but, you know, they... If they can't cast spells, they turn into three Snarkeesians watching the whole thing go down. Now, this, this room is going to kill me because now I want to know what's in it. <laughs> There's got to be something good in it, right? Of course, wizardry doesn't really work that way. It'll just get you killed for no reason. Take away your abilities and squash you with no reward whatsoever. <laughs> That's just the way wizardry is. Oh my goodness. All right, do I dare? Um, wow. It's too bad that like, Wizardry doesn't have like a hit point recovery. So maybe it does. Right? Maybe I check the spell list. Maybe it's got something like that and I haven't learned it yet. <sighs> this, is, this, is, this is what Wizardry does to you. It makes you crazy. Um, wow. Uh, all right. I'm going to take a deep breath and go in. Everybody, all three of you out there watching, wish me luck, please. <laughs> I'm definitely going to need it. Oh boy, here goes. Oh, didn't want to see that. Oh, thank you. Yes, they're friendly. Yes, thank you, Room of Death. <laughs> okay, we'll obviously leave them be. All right. Now, question is, oh, what the hell am I looking at there? There's like rooms within this room. 
Oh, I am scared to get too far away from that door. I am such a wizardry wush, wuss. Or wizardry whoosh as well. Oh, please, no encounters. Please just let me explore all of this room with no more encounters. How much do you love me, wizardry? And not only that, but let me get off the fifth level without any encounters as well. There's a door over there. I'm not going through that. Probably lose my weapons or something if I go through that. Oh dear, I am so scared. I am, I'm really pressing my luck in this room. But if I leave and come, you know when I go through that door, I'm going to get another encounter. Oh crap. I hate your wizardry. I hate you so much. Wow, what is, this is the weirdest room in the history of wizardry rooms. It's not going to give me any rewards here. Are you for reals? I just did all that for no reason? You have got to be kidding me, wizardry. There's nothing in here? <laughs> oh my god. I can't believe it. There's nothing in here. Oh man. That's just, that's not even right. That's, just, all right. Whatever, let's get to the fourth level and get our magic ability back, hopefully without an encounter here killing us. That is so disappointing, what the? Oh, what the hell? Let's head to the fourth level. Get our magical ability back. Uh, okay, so right um, on the fourth level. Let's make sure. Let's make sure we're in sync first of all. And camp. Right, uh, what silly spell? Excuse me, can we cast? So you just go into that room, find nothing besides that you can't cast spells anymore. Great! <laughs> oh, how, how aggravating is that? Yeah, um, spells. Oops. Damn my crossing. That's yeah, just adios. A waste of spell point. Um, Ryan Miller, who's like, wait, I'm not hurt. Okay, so I got my. Spellcasting ability back. Uh, great. Let's leave camp and head back down there to the fifth level and avoid that room like the Dickens. Where the Dickens is. Okay. Um, right. Now, where do we want to go now? Do I want to. There's that hallway up there to the upper right that I didn't explore. Um. There is, what else is there? There's a lot more stuff over on the left. There's a dark patch on the left hand side there by the turntable square. Um, tell you what, let's bite the bullet here and go into that dark patch. Or, no wait, there's that room right by the turntable there. With the, let's, let's go in there and, <laughs> and I hope that that doesn't wipe out my uh, spell casting ability. All right, and the best way to do that is to head down this hallway. Through this oops and encounter. Surprise the monsters, dragon puppy and were rats. Alright. Fight group one, fight group one, uh, fight group two, parry, parry, parry. 14 damage, dragon puppy is killed, nice. 12 damage. Okay, two were rats left. Fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. Were rat is killed. Misses. And the wear rat is killed. Nice work. Okay, 631 experience points. Calfo, that's going to be Gnome de Plume. Trapless chest. We are definitely going to verify that. 
with Snarkedian, Snarkesian's little nimble fingers. Trapless chest. Okay. Let's go ahead and open it. And Snarkesian will do that. Sword. Alright. I got a lot of junk I gotta identify. Which I guess is a good thing. Well, really not in, in uh, wizardry. It's like a zero-sum game, if that's the, the right way to term it. Okay. So, um... Down here, oh, an encounter. Oh dear, and they surprised us. Not good. Not good at all. Whew. I see a Machinito in the near future. Oh dear. Hopefully most of them are missing. Oh my goodness. We are getting very lucky here, folks. <laughs> Oh, thankfully, they're a hapless bunch of bozos. Oh. Alright, so, we want the unseen entities gone first. Two, fight group two. You are going to dispel group three. Gnome de Plume is going to do likewise. Sarkeesian is going to sit and watch. And you are going to cast the Machinito. Like so. Unseen Entity is killed. Dispels two monsters. Nice work. Misses. Misses. I should have cast the Bamatu, shouldn't I have? Misses. 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 Come on, where's Elevator here? I knew somebody was going to get poisoned or something. Uh, 14 damage. Fails. Misses. Huge spider is killed. I think uh, Elevator is going to mop up the floor with these bozos. I think. I hope. She, she, this spell hasn't failed her yet. Hasn't. Oh, look at that. It, uh, a couple left behind a couple bozos. Alright, we got to get rid of that shade right away. Fight. One. Fight group. One. Fight group. One. And you're going to cast a Bamatu. Oops, not a Mabatu. Oops, nor a Nabatu. Bamatu. Perry, and uh, I'll tell you what, we'll cast a Halito at that shade. Bamatu, nice. Oh no! Run DMCA got drained. And of course, we killed a shade two seconds afterwards. Oh, that's so annoying! <laughs> oh, fifth level, I love you. <laughs> Damn, and he's poisoned on top of it. All right, so fight, 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 parry, parry, parry. Nobody said we're never getting beyond the tenth level. Nobody's gonna get to the eleventh level besides Snar Snarkesian. Oh my goodness. Ah, ten damage. Come on, kill this bozo. Thank you. Just had to drain me, didn't you? What did that say? Something about being damaged or poisoned or something? Oh, Calfo. And that's going to be Gnome de Bloom. Alright. And Stunner. Alright, so do we want... Let's uh, corroborate that. It's going to be Snarkeezy and corroborating that. She says it's a trapless chest. Nice. Alright, so... Who did I have? Gnome de Bloom, Calfo. Let's have Van Mike Boss and Calfo. Tell him I've got three different... Alright, let's have Snar Snarkeezy and look at it again. You're already lucky. Yeah, I know, and I got three different answers. Oh, so I got Stunner, Trapless, and Teleporter. Well, of all of them, Teleporter is the one I want to avoid. So we're going to disarm for Teleporter. And if it's wrong, I don't care. Stunner, Disarm, Thank you. Down the scroll, who cares? 38 gold pieces. Alright then. Alright, so we need, what is it? Uh, Latimophis on um, Run DMCA. Let's get into camp. Let's heal everyone. Let's point and laugh at Run DMCA, who I believe is ninth level now. Ah, oh, crap. Fifth level, you are going to be the death of us. You've already been the death of Elevator. Get out of the encounter window, get into the camp window, and let's inspect 
and my posse and have him do the needful. Okay, everybody is cured and healed and Run DMCA is now ninth level. Damn it. Alright, well we'll look on we'll look on the bright side here. It's another opportunity for him to increase his vitality and agility, getting back up to the tenth level, right? Take that wizardry. Shades, I, I hate you. But we're gonna make the best of it. And I think the way we make the best of it is to head back up to the castle. Uh, inventory, identify whatever our loot so far, and um, call it a session. I think uh, I think we'll I think the fifth level uh, has seen enough of us, and vice versa. So, well, let's get out of camp here and head back up to the castle. Oh goodness! Oh, it's not gonna let us back without a fight. Surprise the monsters, animals, now they're going to be most likely, everybody here can breathe on us, I assume, because, oh no wait, there's a there's a, an icon for a cat, so it's probably going to be, anyway, okay, so I think the dragonflies we want to get rid of first, because they're going to be the ones who are going to breathe on us. Fight group two, fight group two, fight group two, excuse me, parry, parry, parry. Dragonfly is killed! Dragonfly is killed! Dragonfly is killed! Nice work. Okay, fight group one. Fight group one. Oop, no, I made you both fight group two. Okay, so you're gonna fight group one. Noom the Bloom is gonna cast Bamachu. And Sarkeesian is gonna watch. Spell Dalto on the group. One, so that we can get rid of those uh, animals, which are most likely some kind of big cat. Oh. All right, Bamatsu, nice work, getting it off right away. Dragonfly is killed, nice. Twenty-two damage, killed, 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 killed. Thirteen damage. Okay, fantastic. Animal runs away. Okay, I think that's everybody. Nope, got one attack dog left. It sure looks like a cat in that icon there, but okay. Whatever. Fight, fight, fight. Parry, parry, parry. Attack dog and misses. Okay, attack dog is killed. Very nice. That gets uh, us 1,500, 1,600 experience points, 38 gold pieces. Did anybody get scratched up? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, fine. Let's get out of the encounter window. And head for the elevator. Get up to the fourth floor. Go through the magic doors that aren't so magic when you have the blue ribbon. Alright, head up the first level. Alright, back at the castle. That dreaded fifth level. Let's think about the havoc it's reaped. Reaped. Wreaked, whatever that word is. Wrecked. Some people, some people say wreck havoc. I think it's wreaked. <laughs> think about the havoc it's caused in Team Foolish Pride's ranks. It's deleveled three characters and killed one. Oh my goodness. Fifth level, thy name is Ponage. <laughs> Alright, let's hit the ball tax here and identify whatever we can. Get Ryan Miller in there, pull the gold. I got a lot of gold now. And uh, it's too bad we can't buy levels back with gold. That would be pretty sweet. All right, what do you have to identify? It's probably going to be like plus one chain mail or something directly like that, right? What do we got here? Here it is, plus one breastplate, which I do not need. So head back in and sell number eight, right? And you do not have anything else left to identify that I can see. I gotta really double check these inventory lists because I keep skipping things when I look at them. Alright, um, uh, run the MCA. Let's pull gold. Have your ID 
identify a crappy little staff. So number eight, what are you? Staff of anointed flelliness. Okay, who cares? Sell eight. All right, and nothing else in your list, correct? Okay. Um, oops, didn't want to exit that far out. All right, then my bossy's turn. Let's pull gold and head into identify. You've got a sword. <laughs> You've got a plus one short sword and a scroll, neither of which I care much about. So identify that. And yep, plus one short sword. Surprise, surprise. And I think we got enough gold for you to identify number seven as well. It's going to be some crappy scroll that I'm going to sell. Okay, sell. Number six. Let's send number six once again. Okay. So now we're going to gold pieces back. Let's leave. And let's have number bloom head in. And cool gold. Identify. Armor! Gee, I wonder if it's plus one breastplate. Let's see what we got. Armor. Leather plus one. Now, that's interesting because I don't know if Snarkeesian has magical armor. I'm pretty sure Snarkeesian has leather, but I don't know if it's plus one leather. Did I actually find something useful? That, that would be awesome. Okay. Let's... Um, Let's have Snarkeesian go in and see what she has to identify and also check what her armor status is, right? Right. Okay, so Snarkeesian and pool gold and identify and nothing. Oh, she already has plus one by it, so never mind. All right, so we're selling that back. Okay, leave. Let's have Nom the Flume go in. Let's have him sell the plus one leather. All right. Very good. And we have one more person to head in. That's going to be Elevator. Pool Gold. Identify your anointed flail that you probably got there, right? An anointed flail. Okay, sell that back. Number three. And that clears out the inventory of unidentified and unwanted items. So let's head to Gilgamesh's, get everybody back onto their bar stools, and have the entire tavern point at Run DMCA and laugh. All right, Gilgamesh's. Remove one, remove one. You hear the laughter? You hear the... The uh, growing laughter. <laughs> All right. That's it, kids, for this adventuring session. Once again, level five. Drop the hammer. It's almost like it's trying to drop the band hammer, but just can't quite pull it off. <laughs> One of these times we're going to go down there and everybody's going to get smoked. All right. All right, everybody, thanks for tuning in. And that's it for this adventuring session. Who knows, maybe maybe I got enough experience points to where uh, somebody else besides Ryan Miller can level in between now and next time. All right, thanks, everybody, for tuning in. See you next time.